study, researchers found that droughts are lasting longer and storms are more unpredictable in the last five decades. Stephanie Omo spoke to a researcher who took part in the study and is live tonight with more. Steph? Christina, researchers went through 50 years of weather data. They discovered bigger changes are happening right here in the desert southwest. What we were really trying to accomplish was looking at the day-to-day -day variations in rainfall across the western United States. But we were trying to take a hard look at the timing of that rainfall. Um, how often uh, the ground gets wet. Researchers went through five decades of data. Dr. Joel Biederman is a research hydrologist with the U.S. Department of Agriculture Southwest Research Center in Tucson. He says they discovered the average temperature increased by 1.5 degrees Fahrenheit since the 70s in the West. The team also found other big changes here in the Southwest. For our region here in the desert Southwest, is that the average annual rainfall declined much more, about three inches. That's about a 30% decline, considering the average amount of rainfall in the desert southwest is around 10 to 11 inches a year. Dr. Biederman says the most surprising discovery was the average length of time between storms. The average dry interval between storms uh, here in the desert southwest has increased from about 30 days in the 1970s uh, to just over 45 days now. So about a 50% increase in how long we have to wait after one storm for the next storm on average. And the changes showed to be happening at a faster rate. Dr. Biederman says he hopes the recent findings will help us all make better decisions. If we could look at the areas where rainfall uh, intervals are growing uh, the most severely, we might be able to prioritize things like uh, wildfire fuels reduction. We might be able to make smarter decisions about how much livestock we can graze on a particular uh, piece of land or, or develop better crops that are adapted to those types of conditions. And Dr. Abiedemann also says it's important for us to think about water storage so we can better prepare and equip ourselves for the future. Reporting live tonight, I'm Stephanie Omo, Fox 10 News.